everyone! I'm here to review one of the most popular masks that has been raved about nowadays on the internet, which is the O2 Curve by O2 Canada mask. Uh, this is a plastic mask with three free filters inside, uh, which retails for 5,000 pesos. Uh, despite its expensive price, I've been um, thinking about not purchasing it before. Uh, because of its price however um, many of my colleagues uh, convinced me that it's one of the most comfortable masks that I've that they've ever worn during this pandemic season I know that it's difficult to purchase masks uh, I know that it's expensive even the regular surgical masks can be uh, very expensive lately Let's start off why I purchased this expensive mask in the first place. Uh, first, uh, in my line of work, uh, I, I'm always exposed to patients who are potentially COVID positive. Uh, I have 24 hour or sometimes 36 hour shifts. Uh, I tried to wear the regular N95 masks, but I tend to get migraines. Um, especially if I wear it for more than four hours. Uh, sometimes I do intraoperative monitoring uh, with patients. So in that case, um, we're required to wear an N95 mask. However, uh, we have to wear like two to three layers of PPE, an N95 mask, and a surgical mask on top of that, plus a face shield. So imagine um, you inhaling all the carbon dioxide uh, for more than four hours. Sometimes I tried wearing um, a 95 mask for eight hours and I couldn't really um, recover from the migraine the next day. I've had terrible headaches. Um, a 95 masks tend to be very uncomfortable, especially in this area. Um, I've been getting marks, and um, the pressure around the side of my head is too much for me to handle. Another thing that I hate about N95 masks are how it fogs up my goggles. So I already have pretty bad vision, and to make things even more blurry, I can't do my work properly. Okay, uh, let's begin by unboxing this uh, new purchase of mine. So it comes with this uh, pouch where you can place your mask. I really like how smooth it looks. It's very sleek. Uh, I know it comes in four different colors. There's a black one, a dark blue one, and a red one, I think, and this white design. It comes with two ear loops, and uh, you put this around your head also. So. In here, uh, you can see the vents where um, every time you exhale, it comes out of these two vents so you don't inhale the carbon dioxide. So let's remove the top part. Okay, and let's get our filters. It comes with, with a cleansing wipe also. So one box contains three filters. So you just place the filter here and apply it on your mask. This one. Here, again, you can see the two valves where every time you exhale, the carbon dioxide just comes out. So let me try to fit this off camera. You can adjust the straps at the back side, just like this.
Let's try to test out if it fogs up my goggles. I'll try my best to exhale as much as I can. So far, it's not fogging up. What I like about this O2 Canada mask is it forms uh, a tight seal around this area. So whenever you breathe out, it won't fog up your goggles since it's part of the PPE that we have to wear. So my eyes are already very blurry in the first place, so I don't need to add more to that. Another reason why I like this mask is that you can still hear me when I talk because most of the patients that I have are hard of hearing and it's difficult to try to social distance when you're when your patient can't hear you so you have to come close to them so it's pointless when it comes to the price uh, if you buy a mask you get three free filters like what I said a while ago and each filter will last will last you two weeks so um, roughly you can use it for more than a month already a separate order of filters comes with 10 filters and it costs 2200 pesos so if, you, if you add it all up you can use it for six months especially in my line of work of course we're always exposed to covid patients uh, it's a very good purchase especially for healthcare workers so i highly encourage you to buy this mask and by the way this is not sponsored by any means since uh, many of my friends have been asking uh, why I decided to purchase this mask, uh, this review uh, is here to help you in deciding whether or not you can you should purchase this mask. Uh, one thing I noticed with my colleagues when they use this mask is. The moisture is usually gathered in this silicone seal right here. So I think it's recommended that you put a tissue just around this side or cotton. And uh, when you clean it, you use alcohol to clean the outer portion. Uh, just replace the filters every two weeks.